Wonderful experience with a knowledgeable and responsive human being can be addictive. Always demonstrating professionalism and personal attention to her clients has established her reputation. Foreseeing problems ahead and giving right advice on time comes natural to Maryam Kuregian. She believes that efficiency is doing things right and effectiveness is doing the right things. Miriam, thank you again for making time for this sit-down interview and allow me to thank you on behalf of our viewers for enlightening them on personal injury laws. It's always a pleasure to have a sit-down talk with you and you ask such intuitive questions, it actually enlightens me as well. So thank you so much for giving me the time and I'm grateful for this opportunity. The pleasure is all mine. Let's talk about the importance of uh, knowing your rights in this day and age. Absolutely, your rights and your liberties are the initial step of starting any proceeding. If you don't know what your rights are, if you don't know what you're entitled, then you really uh, don't anticipate the uh, response that's going to be given to you. So uh, in my profession, it's very important to educate my clients. Uh, to let them know what their rights are and what they're entitled to. And as you know, in personal injury, every single citizen of this country has the liberty to live uh, pain-free. And when somebody's injured and has pain, then it is our duty, our obligation, to make sure that that client knows their rights and knows that they have the liberty to have a pain-free life. Davana Irababanakan Portsarugerasenyak. Ankerutsuna, Voroni Hamutiev Professional Fastabanesh, Gelhavrutiamp, Mariam Kuregiani, Patrasten Zestarayel, Mishark Volorteru, Janapara Transporta in Vatarnesh, Uberiev Lifti Het Kapvats Pataharnesh, Apahovelov, Barcer Vorakiev Stahutsun, Menkara Charkumenk, Merok Nutsuna, Gortuneutian Tasnerek Tarineri and Tatskum, Statsvel and Mironavor Dollar Neri Pohatutsum, Isha Hachahortneri, Vastahekmes, Davana Law Firm. How does someone uh, get a family friend like yourself uh, uh, to be proud of and uh, to say that I have an attorney who is a family friend and she's always there for me? That's the difficult part because you find yourself being pulled in many, many directions. But I think being responsive to your friends and family, being responsive to your clients, always comes at the top of the list. You know, you, you have to have the kind of firm where you're staffed properly to make sure no call, no inquiry goes unanswered. And I, I would honestly say that's the biggest challenge because when you're managing family, career, law firm, friends and family, it can easily get out of hand. But I think I would pride myself in being extremely responsive to my clients because the nature of our business is very, very time sensitive. And also dedicated and loyal. That's why they consider you a family friend. Well, we, we all strive to be uh, perfect at that, but I haven't met anyone who has. So we strive to be perfect, but by no means are we perfect. How do we overcome barriers with the help of a professional like yourself? Well, that's a fantastic question. Thank you so much for that. Uh, barriers can come in different forms. You know, there is a language barrier. There's a immigration status barrier. There's oppression barriers. There's a classification barriers. There's a gender barrier. There's an age barrier. So the barriers are endless. And I think when a client comes to me, my ability to kind of anticipate what those mental barriers might be for my client, I try to anticipate that. I try to indirectly address that so that once the client is here and is asking the questions, I want to make sure that some of those barrier questions are indirectly answered so that by reasoning they're able to overcome those barriers and feel comfortable with our representation. And with our community, uh, some of the barriers I just mentioned are always there. You know, I, I could speak for myself. When, even today. Even today I could speak for myself. When I first came to this country, language was a barrier. My uh, status as a refugee was a barrier as a, f a family standing. Um, 
you know, not thinking that I can go to law school was also a mental barrier. So when a client walks in that's injured uh, through negligence of somebody else, I always try to anticipate, well, what are their mental barriers? What are their physical barriers? How can I facilitate this case in alleviating the burdens of barrier? And I think it's important to foresee those issues so that you can address them even though your client might not have the foresight to ask you those questions directly. And I think confusion also is one of the barriers. Well, confusion comes from not knowing your rights, right? Because we, you know, in our community, again, we have a lot of friends who have an opinion, who say, we know how to do this. Uh, they try to instill fears in you through their experiences. So when a client walks in, uh, they are already filled with a lot of anxiety and preconceived notions about the practice, the result, the anticipated result. So my job is one, to unwind those fears, put together a new plan, through it interject c confidence and have them believe that they're in the best possible hands. And yes, they do have standing. Yes, they do have liberties. And yes, they do have rights. Miriam, you mentioned all these barriers, but knowing all these barriers takes time and experience. Uh, good observation. Thank you for that. Uh, I think these, this kind of knowledge comes over years. You can't really uh, ascertain this knowledge without uh, putting in the time, meeting with clients, working with clients, hearing their true stories of injury and obstacles. So I think a part of my knowledge is years of experience and my ability to be able to sit down, talk to anyone with their own comfort level and get to know them. So uh, part of my knowledge is because of that. And also your personality, because you're caring, that's it. Like I said, I could talk forever. So the fact that we limit these interviews is very important. I can talk forever. And we enjoy it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Davana Irababadakan Portsaru Grasenyak. Ankerutsuna, Voroni Hamutiev Professional Fastabanesh, Gelhavrutiamp, Mariam Kuregiani, Patrasten Zesarayel, Mishark Volorteru, Janapara Transporta in Vatarnesh, Uberiev Lifti Het Kapvats Pataharnesh, Apahovelov Barcer Vorakiev Stahutsun, Menkara Charkumenk Merok Nutsuna, Gortuneutian Tasnerek Tarineri and Tatskum, Statsvel and Milanavor Dollar Neri Pohatutsum, Isha Hachahortneri, Vestahekmes, Davana Law Firm. Zej Husali Gortzankera. Vision through time. Muradzian Patkira Seraha Merkayat Snume. Basmatib Mijas Gain Susan Desneri Mercena Kakis, Florencia I Biennale, Lorenzo Medici, Anvan Patavor Medalina Janatsats, Yelane Karic, Sam Zumiani, Anhatakan Susan Desa. Batsuma Suintevakani Martitas Nerekin, Jama Yerequan Yotin, Hassan Hisunier Kutas Namek Sunset Boulevard. Vertsnar Vatsneri Dinamika, Guineri Lucy Inknati Hamadrutsun. Հրավիրված է արվեստասեր հասարակությունը։ Can you give me an example of a barrier within our community? Absolutely. Uh, one of the prevalent barriers our community has, actually two that come to mind, is one, their legal status within this country, and two, their access to uh, medicine, access to hospitals, because if one doesn't have the proper legal standing within this country, then they're afraid of going to the hospital or they're afraid of seeking the proper medical treatment. And within uh, this kind of profession, I see a lot of injured clients who are truly injured and are in need, but they have reservations about seeking the proper medical treatment. And I think, uh, you know, a lot of times it's over, you know, is overseen. A lot of people dismiss miss this barrier, but I think if, uh, if it goes unnoticed, a small problem can become a very big problem. Miriam, I know that you believe in volunteering and giving back to the community. Yes, uh, that's a big part of my personality. People always ask me why, and at times I question my own uh, motivation, but I think I don't look at it as giving back and volunteering, it's just who I am. Uh, again, going back to talking a lot, uh, as I get to know people, as I understand what motivates them, I get involved in organizations very easily, to 
in which that I feel passionate about. For example, I love my children's school and I love volunteering there. It gives me happiness, it gives my heart contention. Um, similarly, when I joined the legal profession, I joined the Armenian Bar Association because I'm simply curious what are my colleagues doing or, you know, being on the board of directors for the all-inclusive health clinic. Uh, in talking to people, I become curious and then I need to feed that curiosity by being engaged, being involved and giving back. So what motivated you? Just being on the board of directors? Or something uh, else? Well, I believe I, uh, uh, and this might be self-serving in saying this, but I, I'd like to believe that I maybe possessed the skill set that was needed on the board, and I was approached, and once I looked at the curriculum and I looked at the expectation, I realized that, yes, maybe I can be a valuable contribution to the organization, and to an organization that is fantastic for our community. It has no downside. It's, it's an incredible organization. I've been with them for several years now and their work truly, truly is inspirational and uh, I, it's done a lot of good for our community. So the motivation is maybe self-serving. It was to feed my curiosity, but in the end it was to better our community and it has done that. Please tell me a little more about this all-inclusive community health center. Thank you for the question. Uh, all-inclusive community health center is a federally funded health clinic that offers medical access to everyone. And as we talked about barriers within our community, I want to highlight some which uh, are actual standing for not having access to medical care within the United States. Again, going back to your legal standing with this, this within this country, if a lot of a lot of my clients might not have the proper paperwork, which then instills fear in them going to a health provider. Um, with this uh, organization, no questions are asked. You walk in and you are treated. Uh, another barrier is financial barrier. Not a lot of people can afford uh, medical care. Uh, as you know, it's extremely expensive uh, within our country. And this clinic, again, offers the financial help that people might need, families might need when they're under duress. Um, another good example, for example, that I've experienced personally, I knew someone who was uh, in this country uh, and needed immediate uh, help and this, uh, this organization was uh, first in line. I had no reservations in making the recommendation. I had no reservations in uh, making the connection and the treatment was uh, again uh, first class. Davana Irababadakan Portsaru Grasenyak. Ankerutsuna, a Voroni Hamutiev professional Fastabanesh, Gelhavrutiamp, Mariam Kuregani, Patrasten Zestarayel, Mishark Volorteru, Janapara Transporta in Vatarnesh, Uberiev Lifti Head Kapvats Pataharnesh, Apahovelov, Barcer Vorakiev Stahutsun, Menkara Charkumenk Merok Nutsuna, Gortuneutian Tasnerek Tarineri and Tatskum, Statsvel and Milona Vordolar Neri Pohatutsum, Isha Hachahortneri, Vastahekmes, Davana Law Firm. Zej Husali Gortzankera. Vision through time. Muradzian Patkira Seraha Merkaya Tsnume. Basmatib Mijas Gain Susan Besneri Mertsana Kakis, Florencia I Biennale, Lorenzo Medici and Van Patavor Medalina Janatsats, Yelana Karic, Sam Zumiani, Anhatakan Susan Besse. Batsuma Swintavakani Martitas Nerekin, Jama Yerequan Yotin, Hassan Hisunier Kutas Namek Sunset Boulevard. Vertsnarvats Neri Dinamika, Guineri Lucy Inknati Hamadrutsun. Հրավիրված է արվեստասեր հասարակությունը։ True to our mission, our goal is to increase access to health care and other social services for the underserved populations in the greater Los Angeles County, while maintaining cultural competency and sensitivity, providing affordable, high-quality care, regardless of age, race, gender, religion, or ability to pay. All-Inclusive Community Health Center was the first federally qualified health center in the city of Burbank, currently serving in three locations, a patient-centered medical home, 
certified at the highest level and receiving HRSA recognition for quality assurance. For almost a decade, our patients have relied upon us for high quality care. Through time and indicators, we have expanded our services to specialties such as mental health, substance abuse, pediatric and chiropractic care, with a committed focus on educating the community and bringing awareness to preventative care. Our success and the success of our patients is a true testament to our dedicated team of doctors, nurses, management, and enabling staff. Having gained the trust and respect of the community, residents and leaders alike, we continue to build bridges with our collaborative partners by maintaining active involvement with local hospitals, schools, religious centers, and nonprofit organizations. Mariam and I met several years ago. I immediately identified a special level of energy, dedication, and commitment towards helping people. If you've had the privilege to meet her, then you know that she's very much of a people's person, not only in her line of expertise in law, but in many other areas. We joined forces because Mariam also shares the same passion in serving the community, advocating for individual rights. She currently serves as our board chair and is a truly vital asset to our organization, dedicating her time and legal advice with a unique sense of compassion. Miriam and her law firm, Devana Law, is well regarded within our community and a very strong, resilient voice of reason, providing entrusted legal assistance to countless individuals who seek her help. Miriam and I continue to work closely together, which allows us the ability to extend our knowledge and experience to the community at large. Davana Irababadakan Portsarugerasenyak. Ankerutsuna, a Voroni Hamutiev professional Fastabanesh, Gelhavrutsam, Mariam Kureriani, Patrasten Zestarayel, Mishark Volorteru, Janapara Transporta in Vatarnesh, Uberiev Lifti Head Kapvas Pataharnesh, Apahovelov, Barcer Vorakiev Stahutsun, Menkara Charkumenk Merok Nutsuna, Gordunutsan Tasnerek Tarinari and Tatskum, Statsvel and Milanavor Dollar Neri Pohatutsum, Isha Hachahortneri, Vastahekmes, Davana Law Firm. So this organization believes in working with people for the people. Absolutely. And again, tying back to our theme, knowing your rights, knowing your liberties, knowing where to get it is part of that cycle because I find that there's a lot of people within our community who don't believe that such organizations e exist. Even if you tell them, you feel they feel skeptical about it. They feel, well, there is a hidden corner. It cannot be. How could it be? There's, you know, there's some sort of a scheme here. And I, I'm working diligently at shedding those fears within our uh, general population. Uh, I tell my clients about how important transparency is. I tell my clients, these are your rights and no one can take them away from you. And then to add to that, you have the opportunity to take advantage of these, these organizations that are created for the very reason to help people such as you. So transparency, liberty, equates to you following through and getting the kind of help that you need. Miriam, thank you for your continued belief in making a difference. It is my pleasure. You might see it that way, and yet to me, I feel that that's what everybody's doing. I feel that that's what everybody should be doing, and we would be in such a better world if indeed everybody had the similar approach. I believe that the purpose of your life is not just to be happy, it is to be compassionate and useful. Well, I believe that compassion is reciprocal. If you extend compassion, it finds a way to come to you in a different format and there are a lot of sayings and a lot of quotes out there but uh, I have felt it especially in the last year and a half so that compassion is truly what reciprocates and warms the heart so I thank you for your um, efforts and recognizing the compassion in me thank you thank you
Ravana Iravabadakan Porzarugerasenyak. Ankeruciuna, Voroni Hamutiev Professional Fastabanesh, Gelhavruciam, Mariam Kureriani, Patrasten Zestarayel, Mishar Kvolorteru, Janapara Transporta in Vatarnesh, Uberiev Lifti Het Kapvats Pataharnesh, Apahovelov Barcer Vorakiev Stahutun, Menkara Charkumenk Merok Nutsuna, Gordunevsian Tasnerektar in Rientatskum, Statsvelen Milonavor Dollar Neri Pohatutum, Isha Hachachortneri, Vastahekmes, Davana Law Firm. Zej Husali Gortzankera. Vision through time. Muradzian Patkira Seraha Merkaya Tsnume. Bazmatim Mijas Gain Susan Desneri Mercena Kakis, Florencia I Biennale, Lorenzo Medici, Anvan Patavor Medalina Arjanatsats, Yerane Karic, Sam Zumiani, Anhatakan Susan Desa. Batsuma Suintevakani Martitas Nerekin, Jama Yerequan Yotin, Hassan Hisunir Kutas Namek Sunset Boulevard. Vertsna Arvats Neri Dinamika, Guineri Lucy Inknati Hamadrutsun. Հրավիրված է արվեստասեր հասարակությունը։ Գլենդերում է գտնվում Provident Lending Group Հարավային Կալիֆորնիայի խոշոր հիպոթեկային բանկերից մեկը, որը 13 տարի շարունակ օգնում է ձեր տների եւ անշարժ գույքի ֆինանսավորման եւ վերաֆինանսավորման գործում։ Մեր մասնագետները իրենց գիտելիքով եւ փորձառությամբ վճռական են ձեր ֆինանսական խնդիրների շահավետ լուծման հարցում։ Fixed and Adjustable Rate Home Loans, Conventional, Jumbo, FHA, VA, Bank Statement, Stated Income for National, Hard Money and Much More. 21 Day Close Guarantee. Ժամադրության համար զանգահարեք 877-526-2655 կամ 8185450 Glendale Centronum, Harvard, Yev, Maryland, Pogotsneri, Ankunum, Getnavok, Norabats, Mai Salon, Gehetskutian, Seraha, Artenisk, Darcele, Amena Vojain, Kanans, Yev, Tahamartan, Sireli Vaida, Gorna Rachar Gume, Amenoria, Yerekoyan, Tonakan, Yev, Harsanekan, Varsahar Darman, Udimahar Darman, Yurahatuk, Zaraitsunes, and Tarzak, Uner Pachashak, Serahum, Gorzumen, Anvani, Yev, Michas Gain, Janachimunets of Masnaketnes, Mai Salon. Khanam Fatsiev Gravi Chartakini Zer Gravakana. For advertising on Inside TV, please call 818 653 0199.